the Arab world's double standard on Palestine, a betrayal of the Palestinian people. The reasons why the Arab world does not help Palestine are complex and multifaceted. Some of the most important factors include Inter-Arab divisions, the Arab world is divided along a number of lines, including sectarian, ideological, and geopolitical. These divisions have made it difficult for the Arab states to agree on a united front in support of Palestine. Fear of Israel, Israel is a powerful military force with a nuclear arsenal. The Arab states are wary of confronting Israel directly, for fear of retaliation. Economic interests, many Arab states have close economic ties with Israel. These ties make it difficult for them to take a strong stand against Israel, for fear of harming their own economies. Domestic instability, many Arab states are facing their own domestic challenges, such as economic hardship, political unrest, and civil war. These challenges make it difficult for them to focus on the Palestinian issue. Despite these challenges, there are some signs that the Arab world is becoming more supportive of Palestine. In recent years, there has been a growing movement of solidarity with Palestine among Arab civil society groups. Additionally, some Arab states, such as Qatar and Turkey, have provided financial and political support to the Palestinian Authority. However, the Arab world is still far from united in its support for Palestine. The divisions and challenges mentioned above continue to hinder the Arab states from taking a more effective role in supporting the Palestinian cause. Here is a more nuanced analysis of some of the key factors mentioned above. Inter-Arab divisions The Arab world is divided along a number of lines, including sectarian, ideological, and geopolitical. These divisions have made it difficult for the Arab states to agree on a united front in support of Palestine. For example, the Sunni-Shia rivalry is a major source of division in the Arab world. Saudi Arabia and other Sunni states have been accused of supporting Sunni militant groups in Syria and Yemen, while Iran has been accused of supporting Shia militias in these countries. These divisions have made it difficult for the Arab states to unite in support of Palestine, as some states are more concerned with their own regional rivalries than with the Palestinian cause. Fear of Israel Israel is a powerful military force with a nuclear arsenal. The Arab states are wary of confronting Israel directly, for fear of retaliation. Israel has a long history of using military force against the Arab states. In 1967, Israel launched a surprise attack on Egypt, Syria, and Jordan, and quickly defeated them. This war, known as the Six-Day War, resulted in Israel occupying the West Bank, Gaza Strip, East Jerusalem, and the Golan Heights. In 1973, the Arab states launched a coordinated attack against Israel in an attempt to retake the lost territories. However, Israel was able to repel the attack, and the war ended with no significant changes to the status quo. These experiences have made the Arab states wary of confronting Israel directly. They know that Israel is a powerful military force, and they are afraid of the consequences of retaliation. Economic interests Many Arab states have close economic ties with Israel. These ties make it difficult for them to take a strong stand against Israel, for fear of harming their own economies. For example, Egypt has a peace treaty with Israel, and the two countries have close economic ties. Egypt exports a significant amount of natural gas to Israel, and it is also a popular tourist destination for Israelis. These economic ties make it difficult for Egypt to take a strong stand against Israel, for fear of harming its own economy. Domestic instability Many Arab states are facing their own domestic challenges, such as economic hardship, political unrest, and civil war. These challenges make it difficult for them to focus on the Palestinian issue. For example, Syria has been embroiled in a civil war for over a decade. The war has caused widespread death and destruction, and it has also displaced millions of people. The Syrian government is focused on fighting the civil war, and it has little time or resources to devote to the Palestinian issue. Conclusion The reasons why the Arab world does not help Palestine are complex and multifaceted. The inter-Arab divisions, fear of Israel, economic interests, and domestic instability all play a role. Despite these challenges, 
there are some signs that the Arab world is becoming more supportive of Palestine. However, the Arab world is still far from united in its support for Palestine. The divisions and challenges mentioned above continue to hinder the Arab states from taking a more effective role in supporting the Palestinian cause.